This is my ABBA albums ranked worst to best video. Um, so this is kind of, this is completely just my opinion. And it's not even really, like I wouldn't really even say worst to best for this because like none of these albums are bad. These albums are all great um, and I'd recommend any of them. But uh, it's kind of just my, my favorite to, or least favorite to favorite. Um, and this, it's completely like, I know there's probably like some picks on here that people are going to be like, well, what what's he thinking? He's crazy. Um, but this is just really kind of the order that I would, um, if I was like choosing which ones to listen to, kind of the ones that I would pick um, that I'd most like to listen to to, to least. So um, in last place, I have uh, ABBA, their self-titled album. Uh, and like I said, it's not that I I don't like this album because I do actually really like this album. I also think that for some reason when I first got all the albums for the first time was listening to them, this was the one I was kind of the most underwhelmed with a little bit. I think I was just kind of expecting more uh, at this point because I had heard, well this was basically I think the last one of, well yeah the last one I heard of theirs before um, Voyage, the newest one. And um, I don't know, I just, I guess I was expecting more from it because I had been kind of, um, the like the earlier albums I was really impressed with how much I actually liked them um, compared to what I thought I would so I I guess I was thinking I'd really like this one and I I do like a lot of it um, it's got I mean it's got SOS on it that's one of my favorite ABBA songs um, Mamma Mia is like the second ABBA song I ever heard uh, I, I really like Rock Me uh, so it's got a lot of good songs on it but it's just kind of the the one I gravitate towards the least Next, uh, ABBA the album. This is another one that it's like, I, I feel like I, I like it better on, on paper than what like I actually like it. Because every time I think about it, I'm like, oh, that's a great album. But it's just one that I kind of, I don't know, it's like this, the second half of the album, I think, kind of flows different from the rest of the album a little bit. And I think that kind of like throws me off a little bit when I, as far as like enjoying it as much as some of the other albums go, but um, I think it's a good album. Don't have any problems with any of the songs really, just not one that uh, that's one of my favorites. Next, uh, Waterloo. So this this was a hard one to place for me. Definitely, I think like the first time I listened to this album, I would have put it last. But it's one that I've listened to a lot and it's uh, grown on me a lot. And there's just a couple songs on here, like, um, well, strangely enough, like "Sitting by the Pond" or "Sitting in the Palm Tree." I really like that song. Um, uh, Susie, hang around, honey, honey, uh, Waterloo. Just some some songs on it that I really like that I, I put kind of over some of the the songs that I like a little bit less on some of those other albums. So yeah, uh, a lot of people are probably like, "Well, that's way too high for that album." <laughs> um, next. And it's probably gonna. Some people are gonna think this is crazy too, probably. But of uh, Arrival. Uh, so this one, I, I like it a lot. I like a lot of the songs on it, but it just uh, I feel like the first the first song on the album is kind of weak, and that kind of throws off the the rest of it for me a little bit. But overall, really good album. Uh, and next, this one I think everybody's going to think is way too high. I'm going to go with uh, Ring Ring, their first album, which I guess they weren't even Abbey yet when they released this. But I don't know. I, I really like this album. Uh, something about the style of it. It's just I, I like pretty much every song on it. And uh, I've listened to it a lot, actually, since I've got it. So um, I wasn't expecting to like it much at all based on what I'd read about it and people's general opinions. And I think I... I gave it maybe kind of a lower rating than than what I should have when I I feel like when I I first started doing these reviews I felt like I had been like too easy on the Beatles when I reviewed them so I was like trying to be harder on some of these albums but um I don't know I I like the album a lot I think maybe I was a little bit too like didn't act like I did in my review but uh it's just definitely one that I listen to a lot and the more I listen to it the more I like it uh, so up next, I have uh, Voyage, the new album from this year. Uh, some people probably think.
think that this is a little high for this one. I don't know, I just, um, I was really impressed with the first time I listened to it, I liked it, uh, which I wasn't expecting at all. Usually I feel like, I don't know, reunion albums just aren't quite as good as, as what stuff was before. But this, uh, I, I liked it the first time I heard it, and I started to like it more every time I've listened to it since. I think it's a, a really cool album, and uh, it's, it's just really cool that they could put out an album this good after all that time. So, and then uh, the top three. So, uh, number three, I have Super Trooper. Second, uh, second album by them I ever got, and just one that I don't have ever really have a lot to say about it but it's got a, a lot of great songs on it just really like the way it flows um, it's a cool album uh, number two I have a uh, Voulez Vu the the disco album um, I think I've said before I, I kinda like the the disco sounding stuff so uh, definitely just an album that I think is really cool um, and one that I listen to a lot and then my number one, uh, The Visitors. Just, um, I don't know, just a, it's not, then it's not like your typical ABBA album, album, so a lot of people will probably be like, what, that's number one for you? But yeah, I just, I don't know. I, I like the cool, kind of like darker, darker sound of it. Um, and I think all the songs are still really catchy, so uh, number one is The Visitors. And uh, so that's my last ABBA video for now. Um, after this I'm gonna gonna take I think the next week off uh, and then I'm gonna start reviewing the Beach Boys uh, their first album Surf and Safari so um, probably probably will put out some more videos on ABBA at some point but um, that's uh, 